starting out with some stomach anatomy. There are regions to talk about, layers, and some other features. Um, first of all, you hopefully know this is the esophagus. And this is the small intestine, specifically the duodenum. I'm just gonna label it small intestine for now. We've got a sphincter in between those. The upper, lower esophageal sphincter is, is not really ever shown. Um, let's add it. So regions of the stomach, the first one coming in from the esophagus um, is the cardia, kind of near the heart. We've got this big sloping side over here that's called the fundus, kind of like a fungus, like a mushroom. We then have the body is the main part, um, the main body, I suppose. And then we've got down here, the pyloric antrum. This valve is called the pyloric valve. We've got a couple of, couple of curvatures here. One curvature is much bigger. This is the greater curvature. This curvature is much smaller. It's the lesser curvature. And these things would help you orient yourself to looking when you're looking at a stomach. Okay, that's the regions, layers, uh, do that in a different color. Layers on the outer layer, that visceral peritoneum or serosa is this. In here, this would be the lumen. I'll go ahead and label that. Then we've got a bunch of muscle layers, as you can see. So these are all the layers of muscles going different directions. This is our muscularis. Um, there is a longitudinal, a circular, and oblique layers. That's going to allow our stomach to churn and to contract and then churn in all different directions. Okay, and, and that's the same histology as the rest of the digestive system, right? I mean, I, I guess you can't really see it. The lining of this, the inside here, would be epithelial. We'll look closer at that when we zoom into detail, um, but it fits with our anatomy um, histology of the alimentary canal. The other thing you can see here is all those like bumpy, crazy things inside um, adjacent to the lumen, surrounding the lumen. Those are called rugae. Here is a picture of rugae in a, a real stomach that is like deflated. Rugae are folds. When you eat a lunch, your stomach unfolds and expands and fits more. So that's what these rugae are. They're just folds that can expand. Pretty convenient. Okay. 